It was only last autumn when Denis Boucher was packing them in at Montreal. But this season, the Quebec native has struggled and now finds himself pitching his way back to the Big O in AAA Ottawa. It's hard to take when you uh, leave Montreal. You have to come down here, but uh, I mean, they weren't using me up there, so uh, I guess I have to come down here and get some innings in. He has to hit spots. He has to work ahead in the count. But then most pitchers have to do that. Uh, but he realizes his capabilities or, or his limitations, maybe. But his appeal has no limits. The Expo's average attendance was over 36,000 when he pitched. But pitching and winning are two different things. And Boucher wasn't winning. Who knows what, what they're thinking right now. So uh, I'm just uh, doing my work down here, throwing uh, as well as I can. If uh, they still want me and if they uh, need somebody up there, I'll be ready. As will Carlos Perez, younger brother of former Expo Pasquale Perez. He's got a big league fastball, and like Pasquale, likes to have fun on the mound. I like to do it, you know, Bob. He makes me strong when I strike out somebody. You know, that I make the fans so happy. You know, this is like my other brother, Pasquale Melito. Before my organization take, told me he didn't want me to do it when I strike out somebody out, you know. But I say I, I understand, but I can't control. Pasquale Perez was a wild man. One time he missed an off-ramp on the highway and missed his scheduled start in Atlanta. To remind himself of that, Carlos has stitched the highway number, the I-95, on his warm-up jacket. I have the jacket in my apartment right now, and I'd rather bring it here today, but I'm, it's real hot. But I don't know how he missed his stadium. I can't believe it. But don't be expecting either Carlos Perez or Denny Boucher to want to make their own trip down the I-95. What they want is a trip up the 417 from Ottawa to Montreal, a trip they both hope will be one way. Rob Sinclair, TSN, in Ottawa.